Good day guys, uh, it's uh, Jesse uh, with another video of the Linksys RE1000, um, the wireless end range extender. Now, um, this is a video to caution you guys, um, do not buy this product. It's a pure waste of money. If you, if you have too much money and you want to waste it, you probably don't want to waste it on this because um, this doesn't work uh, it does work in the sense it works but it, it doesn't do what it's meant to do it says that it's a range extender but it doesn't uh, it doesn't extend the, the Wi-Fi range what it's meant to do as per the product um, um, as per the product yep yeah. So uh, I had my last video in which I had unboxed the Linksys RE1000, which is a product by Cisco. Apparently there is news that Cisco is selling Linksys um, off to some other company, which may be quite possible because their products are really not up to the mark and their customer service is really bad. Um, so yeah, so in this video what I've done is I have uh, taken it apart, I have opened the Linksys RE1000 to show you guys the inside of what's uh, in the Linksys RE1000. So um, the casing, um, I did not find any screws in the casing, it was more like a click on. Um, you I had to use a screwdriver, um, a, a plate to um, snap this out, and um, that's the that's the main board. Um, it's um, a Cisco main board. Um, so just to show you guys that I've taken this apart because it doesn't do what it's meant to do, and um, it's um, it's a waste of money. So um, I'm, I'm really frustrated that I spend my hard-earned money on this shit. But anyway, um, so uh, so I took this apart out first, and uh, then I took the box. I took it apart. Um, I opened the box. Well, not technically opening the box, but taking it apart. So just to show you guys the circuit board or the motherboard or main board, whatever it's called. Um, we have a Broadcom chipset. Uh, I'm sorry, I can't focus uh, any better because I'm using uh, a mobile camera for this video. So it's a Broadcom HJ1120P20 chipset. Um, and uh, yeah, that's about it. And we have the power supply, which works. So I might use this, uh, or maybe not, I don't know. Um, I might even need this, but anyway. So I'm gonna chuck this in the bin, cause it's of no use for me. Um, that was inside to keep it clipped, to keep the uh, box clipped. And uh, it still works in the sense it, uh, there was nothing wrong in terms of uh, working, but it doesn't do what it's meant to do. So it's a pure waste of money. So if you guys are looking to buy a wireless range extender, this is a waste of money. So it doesn't work. It doesn't do anything. You call up the Linksys guys and uh, yeah they they recommend you the settings or whatever and uh, I've tried everything it, it does work but there is no performance in terms of uh, extension of range um, the fact is that after using this uh, for a few uh, for a couple of weeks um, my range uh, fell uh, I had bad signal instead of uh, a good signal quality I was getting low speed and a bad signal and um, I read um, a few other blogs where 
a lot of people had the same issue and uh, it seems that it's a it's a failed product by Cisco so uh, yeah I'm gonna put this back and chuck it in the bin thanks for watching the video guys